Hello, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna be making some stargazer necklaces and or just a necklace, not necklaces, just one necklace and a keychain. But before we do that, I do want to do a little bead haul and what I got. This is from Timo and AliExpress. And then this is not from Timo or AliExpress, but I do want to show it because it came with everything as well, like at the same time frame it was everything as well but this is like a little capybara her name is zini um and she's from capybara um which i am part of their discord and it's super fun being there and yeah she also has a little boyfriend named zeno but i couldn't afford zeno i could only afford one and i thought zini matched my aesthetic per perfectly so i chose zini over zeno but i do want zeno at some point First, I got this little um, rabbit phone holder that I'm using right now as I record this video. And this is from Timu, I believe, yes. And then from um, Timu, we have this little heart-shaped plate thing. Um, I only wanted this just so I could do like bead ASMR, like bead soup ASMR on TikTok. Um, and then I also got this spoon from Timu just so I can stir it but the spoon is a bit big for it but I guess it doesn't really matter I think it's fine and on Timu I accidentally bought this as well I didn't know it was like selected um it wasn't in my cart but sometimes Timu like you can select like things from your wish list and even if it's not physically in your cart if it's selected it will you will pay for it and then so this was accidentally selected off of my wish list and i didn't realize and um i didn't unselect it obviously i didn't take it off um so unfortunately this was bought accidentally but happy accidents because this fits so much better so yeah <laughs> and from aliexpress by the way AliExpress kind of annoys me because Timu is from different warehouses, right? Is that how Timu works? So why does Timu bring and gives me all in one package from different stores? But then AliExpress, like I had to wait so long because it kept like packages kept coming in different like days and it was annoying. This came in last, so this just came in today. Um, so it's these little heart um little dimming jigs um for the keychain and the necklace and then these little beads so just a bunch of beads for um the stargazer necklace as we all know if you are a vtuber fan stargazer is you um uki violeta's fan base and uki violeta is violet his name like his name literally is violet in spanish so his whole theme is purple so that's what i went with because the fan is also the, the stargazer is also purple and then this little plate from aliexpress as well i also accidentally bought this listen hear me out so i selected this first in aliexpress and then i found this on timu and i was like my listen my like what my plan was can i speak well my plan was to select uh, to like remove this from my aliexpress cart and then buy this from timu so i bought this from timu and then i went to aliexpress and i forgot to take this out so an extra plate um just in case i want to i don't know use one or the other i have no idea and then from also aliexpress it's just like a tablecloth with a white tablecloth um so that way all my backgrounds on my instagram is white because my bed is not white i don't have like a plain white bed sheets i do have another bed sheet that's like it has two lips on it so it's not plain white and then my wall is pink not white but i want the background of my instagram to be white i want it consistently white um so how do i do that with a white tablecloth so i don't want to open it all the way but yeah it's like um for like it's like i don't want to 
open it all the way. Opens it all the way. Oh, there's. Did I accidentally buy two, or does it come with two? But anyway, I think I actually bought two. But yeah, that's just like a backdrop for my videos. And then I got this from Timu. It's just like um jewelry wire to make the necklace. I also got this from AliExpress. It's a um like loop maker for the wires, so I don't have to like do the the whole myself. And then I got some pliers. <sighs> I already had two of these. But I didn't realize I had two of these. So now I have three of these. <laughs> so yay! Listen. I don't know what happened to me. And then from AliExpress, I just got more beads um, because I didn't really have, like I had like a theme in mind, but not really like what I wanted. So I got these stars, which I think I'm gonna use because they're literally perfect. Um, and this that's from AliExpress. This is also from AliExpress. And it's like um, purple stars. This is from AliExpress as well. It's just like a purple mix with like clear white. Again, AliExpress, these are just like necklace clasps um just to close the necklace and then also from aliexpress just the white version of this and then also aliexpress this like container i didn't read that it was like a nail container like nail art container um so i feel like these are a little too small but that's on me for not reading so yikes anyways um i am going to show you um the little charms that i made for this necklace and keychain first i'm just gonna um well as i'm talking i guess i'm just gonna show you the video so first i made this stargazer i love the shape of this i love the egg i don't like the face because it's smudged unfortunately but it, this is for the necklace it's a charm and then this is for the keychain i don't love that shape the egg turned out too flat but i love that face unfortunately <laughs> um each of them have something i don't like i wish that this face was on this body and but they're still cute you can still you can still tell that they're stargazer and this one is not smudged to a point of like me hating it completely so um yeah and also i want to show my little quildren puff this is also very like not um perfect you see there's some splashes of color i tried to make a texture that will look like puffs and you can't see it but this is for my next necklace i don't think i'm gonna do a keychain for it maybe i don't know i'm not sure this was like a pain to make even though it's literally just like a feather and, and a ball but it was a pain to make um but um this is gonna be for my next keychain or my next um necklace and it's children which is the fans of ike evelyn so without further ado uh i don't think i'm gonna start today just because me and my mom are watching the remaining if you don't know what the remaining remaining is it's a great movie about like the end of the world um i don't know how biblically biblically accurate it is but it's fun to watch and i also want to watch left behind which is i think is more biblically accurate than the remaining um, I think the remaining was just like a lot of more suspense where left behind is like actually like informative. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to keep watching movies with my mom. And then tomorrow I have to wake up early because I took summer shift and I'm kind of regretting it. But hey, if I want to buy more of these, I got to work. Um... So I don't think I'm going to start it now. I'm just going to do some TikToks of like bead hauls and then that will be it, I guess. Um, and I'll start tomorrow. I have to figure out how 
to work this and then I also have to actually design the necklace so I'm gonna do that tomorrow after I'm done work um but I'm excited I'm so happy that it's here um so yeah I kind of so these are the ones that I tend I really really want to use right I really want to use this these little flowers and then I really really want to use these stars so Oh, and these like for fillers because obviously I don't want purple, 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 purple. I do want some like separation. So white is that separation. Um. Also, these are like pink. Do these look pink to you? These look pink to me. Is it purple on the listing? But anyways, I digress. Um. So yeah, that's gonna be. I'm so excited. Look at these. Um, yeah, I'm so excited. Can't wait. So right now, I'm just going to quickly make a plan on what I want, on what beads I want, and where I want them, and then I'll show you it. So, don't mind the chocolate. This is what I have so far. My dilemma is, should I make this a loop, right? Maybe over here is going to, um, what you might call it, connect? and have these little stars hanging off or so maybe more or have it fall down and have this at the end hanging off i'm looking towards the loop but i don't know let me know so i'm kind of debating switching the charms so instead of having this big one as the necklace charm have it as the keychain charm and then the little one as the necklace charm just so it fits better with all the other beads um i think that's what i'm gonna go for because keychains usually are more like like for keychains you could have the bigger charm and it'll look good but as i laid the necklace down with the big charm it just looked really weird and bulky so i might just change it to the little one this is what I have so far, and I'll, although I love it, I do want to bring it up right here. So unfortunately, that does mean that I have to redo some things to make it a little tighter, which is going to be a pain. I don't know if you can even see it, but yeah. A little too loose for my liking, so I am going to take it up a notch so yeah all right so i tried it on and i can't get it on so that means i took a little bit too much Ooh, so i have to put it in at least two bins that two beads that i took off so let's do it again so i did change my shirt to match the vibe but here it is um, I did have to adjust it one more time, but I am... Where's your face, buddy? Alright, there we go. Okay. So his face is gonna move a bit, but that is the necklace. And tomorrow I'm gonna start on the keychain. All right, so I noticed that this is attached a little bit weirdly right here. We can see this is more loose. This is more like uptight. Here we go fix that. All right, finally, it is officially done. Here it is. I just had to fix and add a, I just had to add a, another O-ring and that made it equal to the other side. To wiggle around with it. Actually, that's pretty good right here. Yeah, so that's the necklace. Yeah, I absolutely love it, and I'm gonna try the keychain tomorrow. I kind of popped off. Oh, it looks so good. So I finished um both the keychain and the necklace and 
that will be all for today's video i actually really enjoyed the process i first i was frustrated a little bit but i think i got the hang of it now i'm gonna keep doing this i really love it um my sister already asked me for a red one um so i'm gonna do hers after i do like evelyn's children so i am doing um children's i'm not gonna do two clay charms i'm just gonna do one for the necklace and that's it and then the keychain is gonna be just like little beads that i buy um just because the charms um take a lot of time and you know plus connecting the wires and doing the loops and all that even though i have the one one step looper um there was a bunch of beads where i had to redo the loop um i don't know if it's because i bought the looper from aliexpress and not amazon so it's a little like janky but i did have to um remakes a lot of the loops that um the looper made but i still love the looper it still makes the process more efficient even though i have to um fix some of them but i still love it i'm still gonna keep using it it's so much better than just doing it by hand um so yeah i hope you guys like it. i'm gonna throw some pictures again follow me on tiktok you get like um you get to see these things way before the youtube video is up and follow me on instagram as well because you also get to see these things before the video is up so thank you so much for watching i am gonna do another video for cool Jeans necklace and i hope to sell these soon i'm gonna first put up uh, like start building up my portfolio and then i'm gonna like put it up for sale but um i already have someone asking on tiktok to sell to like buy it so that's amazing um but i hope you guys like it god bless you all and i'll see you in the next one bye